of y'all might not agree on what I'm saying, but baby, at this point, it is what it is. It is what it is. Cause wrong. The first red flag, the first thing that you do wrong, the first thing that I see is like, mm -mm, no, no, no. I'm gone. I'm leaving. What do you mean? It's giving very much racist to me, but uh, we ain't gonna talk about that one, are we? We're not gonna talk about that one, are we? Oh, okay. <laughs> What is up everybody? It's your favorite skinny legend back with another video. Hey, oh, before I start this video, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Make sure I turn that post notification bell on to be notified every time your favorite skinny legend posts another video. I'm just gonna give y'all a little second to do it because y'all know y'all be lying, so go do what you gotta do. You did it? I'm gonna give you a couple, couple more, couple more seconds, couple more seconds. Okay, so in today's video, as you guys see by the title, I will be doing my unpopular opinion. The things that just bother me, like the things that y'all need to stop doing or just, ew, stop at this point. It's getting tiring. Stop. And if you're new to my channel, hi, my name is Zoe and I make content. I can't really say what content I make. I make things everywhere so just subscribe to the channel girl and just come on the journey with me or boy come on the journey with me like at this point because baby like why why won't you why won't you like you feel me why won't you if you are a returning subscriber hi sting you already know what's gonna happen you already know you already know i don't even have to say too much to you girl you already know but without further ado you guys let's get into this video so, i have 11 unpopular opinions that i have i just put one down because i was like oh true yeah that that you're right you're right you're right so i have 11 unpopular opinions that i'm going to tell y'all like i said let's get into this video so my first unpopular opinion is my first un do you need a second do you need a second because girl you cannot speak today and it's no no so my first unpopular opinion is when you are trying to tell somebody about your life and then they try to like relate to it. Like you can be like, girl, I'm just so depressed. Like he cheated on me. He broke up with me. And it'd be like, girl, right, exactly. Like, girl, just listen to what I got to say. You don't even have to relate to what I'm just trying to say. Just listen, Linda. Just listen. Like you don't have to do the most. Like you don't. Like you don't. Like I'm literally just trying to rant to you and you're trying to relate to me. Like you don't need to do that. You don't. I don't. Like I was saying, you don't need to relate to me. Just hear me out, and then you can give me a therapy session when we're finished. You don't have to do the most and just try to relate to me. No. Next unpopular opinion is Nicki Minaj was better back in the day than she is now. I don't really listen to Nicki Minaj like that, but the songs that I have heard, it's like, okay, okay, Nicki, but it's not like how it was. Like, I don't, I don't know how to make that make sense, but back in the day, yeah, she was, yeah. Pills and no, oh, that's not Nicki Minaj. Is that Nicki Minaj? Did she make pills and potion, y'all? Cause I don't, I think she did. <laughs> pills and potion, yeah. And then it's some other songs that she really, she really went hard on. But now she just really be talking about nasty stuff, dirty, dirty, nasty stuff. Girl, we do not need to hear about you right in somebody's face. We don't need to be hearing about how big his little thing is. We don't need to be hearing about that, Miss Ma'am. So, but I mean, she a grown woman, so she can do what she want. But I'm just saying, like, do what you want to do. Go, go ahead, Nikki. Go ahead. Man, the Nikki fans don't attack me because y'all be going hard for no reason. Third unpopular opinion is when people try to fake depression. Because I'm going to get into it. Because, first of all, it's really people out here really depressed. It's really people out here really, like, like really diagnosed with it. And when people try to self-diagnose themselves with depression. Girl, the party's over. Get your turn to call at this point. And people, sometimes people do it to get attention because they don't get attention. Like, I understand that you want attention, but it's people that's really going through that out here. And you're just acting like it's a joke. And depression is not a joke. Depression, that thing is not a freaking joke. Like, that's, that come from the heart. Depression is not a joke. Like, depression is a real. That joke is real. But I got God, so, you know. <laughs> so, you feel me? Like, rebuke that. What I do is rebuke that depression. Maybe pray about it, girl. Girl, and 
But like, please stop doing that. Stop trying to fake depression because you're trying to seem cool or you want attention. It's people that's really going through it and people that really do that on it, like go through it on a daily. And you just take that as a joke. Like, it's not funny at all. It's not. So stop. Thanks. Management. My next unpopular opinion is when people complain about their life but refuse to take responsibility for why their life is like that. I know I just spoke facts. No, I just, congratulations to me. Pat me on the back. Come on. Pat me on my freaking back. Because, baby, yeah, I said that. Just put it out there. So, people, they would be like, oh, my goodness, I'm so young. Like, I'm not even going anywhere in my life. Who's fault is that? That's nobody but yours. You want to sit on your butt. You wanted to do that. Take your take responsibility of your actions. Even when in relationships, like take responsibility of your actions. You're like, oh, he's doing this, oh, he's doing that, or oh, she's doing this, oh, she's doing that. Why is she acting like that though? Why is she doing that though? You take responsibility of what you did and why they are doing that, or why you are still in this predicament that you're in now, and fix it and move forward from it and try to, <laughs> to stop. <laughs> but Take responsibilities for your actions and what you are doing and try to change it. If you want to, if you really want to change, you will change your life. The only person that can change your life is you. The only person that can do it is you. Don't try to blame it on anybody else because the only person fault it is, is you. So, take that L and move with it, you feel me? Next. Next. My fifth unpopular opinion is when people stay in toxic relationships just because they love them. Okay, because Zoe, you didn't have to put yourself up there like that. Like, let's let's elaborate on this a little bit. Just because, and people say that females that stay in toxic relationships are weak. They they're weak because they um they don't want them. What what is the word? What am I trying to say? What am I trying to say? People stay in toxic relationships because they love them, or they think that they can't find anybody else, or they think that without them they're gonna be lost. Girl, girl, boy. Whatever it is, okay? Let me tell you. Before before them, you were doing fine. So with them gone, you're still going to be fine. Yes, it's going to be tough. Yes, everything, you know, might seem a little hard. But you're going to be okay at the end of the day. Like, that's just a boy or a girl that just affected your life. Just, but if they're treating you bad, being toxic to you, leave. Leave. But, like, abuse relationship, I don't know what to tell y'all. Because I honestly... I don't know what to tell you in a abusive relationship. Girl, girl, you better run away. Pack them bags. Check the dash while you sleep. Because, girl, mm, 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 mm. no, ma'am. No, ma'am. You're going to be fine with them or without them. That's how I feel about it. And if you feel like you can't find anybody else, someone out here is going to treat you right the way you want to be treated. Someone out here is going to love you. Ooh, it's kind of hot in here. It's kind of hot, y'all. This, this ring light making it a little hot. All this light. But someone in this world is going to love you the way you want to be loved. Someone in this world is going to treat you like you're a princess, like you're a queen. Don't settle for less. Don't settle for less at all because you deserve better and you know you deserve better. So strive yourself for better. You feel me? I mean, you therapist me, please, baby. Because at this point, I'm giving y'all tips and tricks. You feel me? Yeah. My next unpopular opinion is ghosting people. I'm not going to lie. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of ghosted people. I'm not gonna lie, I have ghosted people in the past. Not really in the past. But I have ghosted people, um, maybe because I've probably seen a red flag because of past relationships that I have been in. I have seen red flags and I was like, uh uh, this is not gonna happen again to me. No, ma'am. You're, I'm not talking to you no more. And that's how it be. And it's just like, but probably you have hurt the other person because probably they really wanted something with you. But your past trauma messed that up. You feel me? But, red, y'all, I'm I'm learning. I'm learning. The first red flag, the first thing that you do wrong, the first thing that I see is like, mm -mm, no, no, no. I'm gone. I'm leaving. What do you mean? I don't need to explain myself or nothing because at this point, you're acting weird. You're moving funny. Like, no. But it be reason that you be ghosting people. Like, even other people ghost other people, not just me. For me, like, the thing is, ghosting is not okay, and don't make it okay. You know what I mean? Don't make it okay. Next, I'm popular opinion, y'all. Um, Having sex at a young age just to seem cool or, oh, then we go. That's going to be, that's going to be the next one. Okay. Right. Like I was saying, having sex at a young age, that is not cute. If you, if you got raped, molested, is rape molested? 
if you got raped, I mean, like, you know, I'm not talking about you. You're not, you're not in this at all. But I'm just saying, like, just to seem cool, just to be like, oh, yeah, I had sex. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's me. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm. No. No, baby. No. I mean, that's not cute. It's not cute. You're 13, 14. Like, what are you, what are you doing, bro? What are you doing? And then when you, I bet when you grow up, you're going to be like, oh, shoot. I should have never did it. Oh, shoot. I should have waited. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Just because you want to fit in. Just because you want to seem cool. No. No. Take your time. Take your time. If you don't want to lose your virginity, don't lose it. If you want to, with all means, with all means, go ahead. But I'm just saying, like, don't do it just to seem cool. Don't. Don't. Just because everybody else is doing it, don't mean that you need to do it. Be a leader and not a follower, baby. We love our leaders and not followers. We love them. Kisses to you, baby. I love you. The next one is tempting somebody to lose their virginity just because you did it already. You don't be forcing nobody to do nothing. Because if they don't want to, they don't want to. Like, you know what I mean? And then they be like, oh, yeah, girl, because it felt this way. Oh, yeah, girl, because you need to do it. Like, girl, you need to lose it. Like, I'm not playing. And they be calling you. They be like, oh, you're a punk because you ain't want to lose it. No, I ain't a punk. I'm just smart. You feel me? You feel me? Like, some people don't want to do it, and that's perfectly fine. If you did it, that's perfectly fine. But don't be forcing other people to do it. Like, if they want to take their time, if they want to keep it, don't make them seem like they're a punk. Because they're not. There's nothing wrong with being a virgin. It's nothing wrong with not being a virgin. Don't be trying to force people, though. Let's move on, because that, that was going to make me mad. The next one is deciding your personality off of your zodiac sign. They be like, oh, yeah, I'm a cancer, so I'm sad. Oh, yeah, I'm a cancer. This is why I'm such a crybaby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm a Gemini. That's why I'm crazy. Oh, no. No, your zodiac has literally nothing to do with your personality and stop trying to make that up for, you know, what you do. Like, no, that's not an excuse for what you do. You're crazy because you're a Gemini. You have two sides. You're bipolar because you're a Gemini. No, you're just yourself. Like, simple. Like, stop trying. Don't like zodiac signs to base on you. I know sometimes it be true. I know sometimes you be like, oh, shoot, like, they was right on a dot. Like, bro, I really be doing that. I understand. But don't push it a little too far. This point is kind of sickening and it's kind of tiring. Next one is degrading black people because of their color. And I want to go a little bit more in depth into this because y'all, people be doing this a lot. I'm not going to say y'all because you personally, you're not probably doing that. But like a lot of people, they be like, oh yeah, you're black so you're dumb. And they be like, oh, you're black so you're going to be a gang member. Or you're black so you're going to sell drugs no it's so many black black educated people like it's so many of them and it's like all y'all see is color all y'all literally see is color y'all can't see beyond color and it's annoying because they could be smart they could have a good education they could be on their stuff they can have everything probably more money than you but you're degrad but you're degrading them because of their skin color get it together stink about it because no no that's what we're not finna do. We're not finna degrade our black queens and kings, okay? That's what we're not finna do. I don't have this in my nose, but I'ma say it. For the black, for the black men that be that be degrading black women, it's terrible and it's embarrassing. Because first of all, y'all, we're we're the same color, babe. But they, but they be like, oh yeah, I only mess with white girls, only mess with light skin. But that's just my preference. That's just my preference. Understand that. Oh, Cause y'all be using a preference for anything like y'all be using a preference for anything and it's kind of embarrassing because why don't degrade the black don't degrade the black queens just because your mother treated you wrong thanks stink my next unpopular opinion for the movie directors the for the movie directors we finna get at you too baby you thought we forgot about you on the man Oh no, man, we didn't forget about you. Okay, so my unpopular opinion is stop putting black people as animals for half of the movie. First of all, name one black movie, cartoon movie, name one cartoon movie that a black person is not an animal or turn into an animal for half of the movie. Can you name one? Can you? Oh, okay, like we mm -mm. y'all be giving y'all be getting the white folks the whole full part. They don't they don't be no dog. They don't be no cat. They don't be a frog. They don't be none of that. No. So we gonna need the same energy. We gonna need the same energy. Stop trying to play us like we really animals like that because that's so disrespectful and that's so em embarrassing for your show and your movie. So the next time you decide to put us as an animal, watch me. 
watch me because that's no no we need the same energy and y'all not giving what's supposed to be gay with the same energy who didn't want nobody to put you as an animal so why you put us as an animal oh okay it's giving very much racist to me but uh we ain't gonna talk about that one are we we're not gonna talk about that one are we oh okay my last unpopular opinion is don't mix up rudeness with honesty this is a big one because y'all be like, or they be saying, oh, I'm just bold. Oh, I'm just bold. No, you're just rude. You're just disrespectful for no reason. Like, you're really, and that used to be me. I ain't gonna lie to you. That really used to be me. Like, I used to just be like, okay, but I'm just honest. Like, I'm just being honest. No, you're being rude for no reason. You are. Like, you are. And that's not cute or okay. It's not at all. Stop acting like it is because it's not. Don't get it mixed up. It's two different things. Being honest it's just like, even if you're just being honest, keep it to yourself. Like, some people be like, oh, yeah, I just think she's ugly. And they say it to the girl face. Like, keep it to yourself. They just be like, oh, no, I'm just honest. Oh, no, I'm just bold. No, you're just rude for no reason. Like, you're rude for no reason. You're putting people down for no reason. What if that girl is insecure? What if that boy is insecure because he thinks that he's ugly and stuff, and now you're just adding more to it? And now that, that can just be the end of their life because you want us to be honest. And my next unpopular opinion, y'all, this ain't my last because I'm just going to keep going. My next unpopular opinion is when people try to put a hot girl summer as being a little thotty body. No, mm, ma'am. My hot girl summer is going to deal with me chasing that bag, baby. We're trying to get monetized. I'm not playing about that. I'm not playing about that. Matter of fact, not even monetized. I'm really just trying to reach 1,000 subscribers. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm really just trying to run it up. I'm trying to run it up at this point because baby that's all I'm trying to do I'm not trying to be I'm my goal is to really be monetized next year Wait, okay I'm gonna say it now I'm gonna be monetized next year and if not a couple months after the year as a hot girl summer as trying to be a thotty body no some people want to really be a thotty body and just do everything and a hot girl summer is not having sex with any every every and anybody a hot girl summer just could be you chilling with your friends you just having fun regardless of having sex with somebody or adding bodies to your name like it could just be us having fun like oh and my other public opinion is y'all i'm just going on because at this point y'all really got me on this one Y'all really got me on this one. When boys try to be like, when boys try to be like, oh, your friend, your friend is a thotty body, so you're a thotty body. What she got to do with me? What she got to do with me? I'm, I'm fighting for my life. I'm fighting for my freaking life. And it's like, okay, I see that she doing her, she doing this, but that's not me. That's not me. Why are you put, why are you doing that? Cause that's not even me. But I do see I do see where boys coming from. Like, oh, her friends like this, so she must be like this. But it's always not. It's really not like that. And the best friend group be the loyalist one and little thotty body one. Just saying. True. It's not the facts. Because they want to be a thotty body. Don't mean that I want to be a thotty body. So yeah. And my next unpopular opinion, and how this is my last one. This is my last one. I'm just gonna have to make a part two. But my last unpopular opinion is getting attachment and being toxic mixed up. The attachment is like where y'all like really can't be around each other. Like when y'all are, it's like y'all arguing, but with y'all when y'all together, it's like, oh, my stink. Oh my goodness. Like let's make a TikTok together. Y'all know that TikTok was like, mm, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm talking about that one. You know how to explain toxic. Everybody just put out toxic out of proportion all the time. So I don't know how to explain that when I mean shoot. Okay, y'all, this is the end of the video. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Make sure I turn that post notification bell on to be notified every time Facebook can let you post another video. It is free, just hit the like button. It's free, just hit the subscribe button. So why not do it? Why not do it? Why not do it? Why not? okay so hit it girl now you guys are having a blessed day a blessed evening or whatever you're watching this video i hope your day was well and i hope everything manifests that you want to manifest but without further ado skinny legend out Mwah.